Hey guys, this is Scott and I got something for you on the floor of the ocean using Google Earth Map. Now this is going to blow your mind, so hit that like and subscribe button because it really helps me out. Thank you. Okay, here we are with Google Earth Map. Now this is the online version, not the downloaded version. First thing you got to do, turn up the brightness on your computer screen. Boy, that makes a difference, doesn't it? Yeah, it does. So this is the brightness, and this is the object I want to show you. It's right off of Portugal, and it's been there for thousands and thousands of years. Now look what it's done. Look what it's created. Now here's Portugal right over here. Here's Spain over here. And as you zoom in, you can see this triangle structure that's almost a quarter of a mile tall okay quarter of a mile tall and 13 kilometers long <laughs> i'm using miles and kilometers sorry so used to it now look at this look at the trail behind it it goes all the way down here it goes all the way across this thing has been dragging across the floor of the ocean i would say for thousands of years and it's been coming down here it was over here so it probably landed around there but there's a lot of these floor crawlers out there look at this trail it's leaving look at this trail and what are they doing moving along the ocean floor I believe they might be mining or just moving to places more convenient out of the way to stay out of the way of humanity a lot of human civilizations have uh, navies and militaries and submarines and they want to be left alone so they move from place to place it's very convenient and this object obviously is some kind of spaceship that landed a long time ago and is moving locations on the ocean floor now this is the online version okay the online version shows you a better quality map now if you use the downloaded version this is what it looks like the quality is much less you see you can't see any detail because they put these ocean waves on top of it a PNG of ocean waves a PNG is a semi-transparent um, uh, photo and they put these semi-transparent photos of ocean waves on top of it so you literally can't see anything except it looks like shadows when it's further away the ocean waves disappear and you could see it more clearly so this is the downloaded version this is the online web version the internet version so use the internet version if you want to see this thing clearly look at the detail on this incredible detail now let's look at the map and see how long it is just from one side to the other whoops there we go one one side of this thing is 14.4 km across what's that in miles what is that in miles meters where's miles there it is 8.95 miles long oh my god so this total thing how big is that let's start new the total length of this thing is like a v this thing is like a v is 16.5 miles or in kilometers wow 26 km long that is nuts guys and look at the trail see there's no trail behind, in front of it moving there but there's a huge deep canyon like trail going behind it now let me see if I can make it a little brighter to see it there we go you can see the trail hits this area it might even wow does it keep going it keeps going doesn't it this thing is creating roads all over all over the ocean floor look what this thing is doing on the ocean floor look at this look at these trails all over it. it's like creating ocean graffiti what the hell is this structure what the heck is this now it's really close to uh, Portugal and Spain as I said you can see right over here is Portugal and uh, Spain is right over here now let's measure the distance from Spain itself let's take the measuring map boom boom okay we have 20, 162 km away from the land or 
100 miles even. Holy crap, that's weird. 100 miles even, that's kind of cool. So it is relatively close to land, but far enough that nobody on the land is going to ever see your ships leaving, coming, or going. So, guys, that's just amazing, isn't it? And remember, here's this object close up. Here's this object close up. And here it is on the downloaded version close up. Big difference, isn't it? This one has a higher quality resolution. Okay, just for a second, let's look at this and look at the quality when I sharpened it. Okay, guys, uh, here's the sharpened version. At the center, you can see it enlarged and sharpened, and it really does look like some kind of triangle craft. And I believe these, these V-like wings open up to be one long wing once it enters space that is just amazing guys and i'll put the coordinates to that in the about description below the video please hit like and subscribe share if you can and question everything scotty Warren signing out